Hmm. Could it? It is your place. Very good, Bill. You found it. And how do you? Good qu That's a... Now we just need to figure out what... That is the... Maybe you should go back and re... The protective... No one can... End. That's just... The symbol... The wall... A depression in the ground. According to the book, that fire symbol, a depression in that would be the symbol. The soil symbolizes that's the symbol for air. The air symbolizes the mind. Let's see what I... Here it says, as steep, good, and the symbol on the, it says here, the fifth element is more than just the quintessence or the ether of the meta element that lies between and behind everything. And ultimately, every author avoids its clear definition, of which every practitioner takes a different view. Oh dear. And it just keeps on like that. In an operation of intention, the fifth element thus represents the quintessence and thus both the ability to be able to perform this operation adequately as well as the proper authorization. And what does that mean? Well, you could see a rit- Really? She's right. A ritual is a- uh, And a it- Happy hunt. A mirror like this. Hello, Father. Uh, hello. Why does an exorcism have to be a ritual in the first place? An exorcism is not a simple matter. We must free Greta's secular body of the otherworldly possession and reclaim her soul. And how do we do that? It's not that easy. Rituals work through symbols. We must see to it that every power, every factor in the ritual, is somehow represented by symbols or symbolic objects. Then the symbol's powers join forces, and the ritual's effect unfolds. And the powers do what they're supposed to uh, in... I found... Oh, There's an ancient stone circle up near the old mill. Is it suitable for such an in... Uh, uh, can you draw a uh, circle of... Yeah, you... I... Do you still have a few can... Unfortunately, no. Greta's stock. I fa In a ritual, it is supposed... Very. But it makes sense. Hey, and you need a tool to... What would I need to imp... Hmm, that question... You need a really powerful artifact that will let you separate the possessed, in this case, Greg. What could be considered? Hmm. We need. Now that. Difficult. Whatever. It. I for the four. X. I guess that makes sense. So, what? Then. I have. 
Yes. Now that we have it, sounds to me like a job for McCallum. Hmm. That might just prove a tad difficult. Why? Well, I sort of broke out of jail together with Bloomford, and kind of gave him a bit of an electric shock in the process. And well, then somehow locked him up. Oh dear, yes, I remember. Well, then you'll have to find someone else to help you. But who? You have to ask someone whom you trust and who meets the physical requirements needed to get Greta to the ritual site in her current state. Now that Tifted Remember it I'll be gone. Hmm, that looks like some kind of mechanism which rings the holy bell. I'm just not sure if seeing as it's something that Bloomford built, I can almost Another one of those flat I really think that it's the Hmm, Bell. If Greta really is possessed, then the it's a wonder that that could work. But fetch Another st this one, however. I can't. A tomb. There's something else. Who found death? That explains the necropolis. Fine. Maybe. Maybe. Cool sword. Cool. Well, considering that he's always leaving his stuff. That would be a really power fact I could use to sever the demon from that. If that doesn't empower me, then I. But where is it? This disc. I can't read. Aha! <laughs> Someone's shooting at me. works. This whole matter thing is kind of exciting. Look, the symbol won't stop shining. Now two of the symbols are shining. symbols are lit up. So what happens now? What's going on? Looks like some kind of gondola. Well then, up you go. Oh boy. Heaven almighty. Now that's what I call an armory. Ouch! 
Right. I guess I can't just take it that easily after all. The Sword of Michael. But I can't just take it because it's protected by that pseudo fire effect. Looks like some kind of crystal or prism. Seems it focuses the light into a beam that falls on the sword. I can't reach that. Holy mother of God! Now that's a statue! Isn't that Michael? <laughs> the old blowhard. That would certainly fit the order. The Archangel Michael. Conqueror of the Devil, Guardian of the Garden of Eden, Companion of the Dead, Judge of Souls at the Last Judgment, and Leader of the Heavenly Hosts, and Bearer of the Flaming Sword. Well, what do you know? It looks like he really did leave it lying around somewhere. It won't work like that. I can't reach that. Looks like some kind Hmm, I'll tear a piece off here. The leftover scraps. Oh, they can be reorganized. Why don't you put them together to make something really... A pile of little spitballs. <laughs> Whatever you would use them for. Ha! Bullseye! Now a little less light passes through the prism. And another one. Yes, got it. Now there's not so much light going through the prism anymore. All right. It seems the fire has disappeared from Michael's sword seeing as it's hidden from God's light. Kinda looks smaller without the fire. That's the way it is sometimes. All right, okay, that won't work either. Hmm. Ha! I actually have Michael. Who knew? But now let's get back to the surface, so that we can perform the exorcism, and you can get back to heaven, before anyone finds out you were gone. Michael is going to be so embarrassed when you show up with his sword. <laughs> Basin of holy water. Nice of the church to offer that here.
consecrated soil from this take the soil with me for now. Hmm, alchemical fire, good idea. Aha, the stone is is permanently activated. That's the way it's supposed to work. Hmm. Aha! That seems to... I'll take... Hello, Bill. Well, howdy, Talaret. It's about... Oh, no. She's possessed by a demon. Now you're getting carried away, boy. No, really. Actually by an angel, a fallen one. But uh, it comes down to the same thing. Can you help me? A demon? I mean, Greta's a few pages short of a complete Bible, but uh, a demon? Yes, and I need help with the exorcism. We need to grab Greta and take her to the ancient stone circle. Exorcism? That sounds dangerous. And you just can't go jailing Inquisition people? Don't that get you thrown in hell? They wish. And what if you're wrong? You got any evidence? Of course I can prove it. Look at all the crazy stuff she's spreading around. Look at this. For the protection of life and limb, I decree that no one is allowed to enter this mill. The risk of collapse is too great. Anyone... That sounds like great... Nothing. If you can to help. But we can't just run around doing exorcisms on every harpy that comes along. Where'd we be then? I'll be going then. Oh, they can be reorganized. Why don't you put them together to make something... It won't work. So the new decree now states, in the name of the incarnate portal sign, 
How is this makes great? Oh, they can be reorganized. Why don't you put them together to make something really strange? So the new ticket now states, for the purposes of the municipal... How ex... Hello, Bill. Well, howdy, Talleran. It's about Greta. Oh, no. She... Well, no. I have proof that Greta is possessed. What if you're wrong? You got any evidence? Of course I can prove it. Look at the insane things she's coming up with. Look here. In the name of the Incarnate, I decree that playing children are to be captured immediately and thrown into the Holy Inquisition's cells that they may receive their just punishment. Every mortal sin must have its reward. Signed, Greta. Greta really has lost her mind. But why don't you go to McCallum? It's his job to maintain law and order around here. He, uh, he's indisposed. What? What do you mean, indisposed? He's gone mad from grief because Greta's been possessed by a demon. Another accusation. You got... Of course I can prove it. For the purposes of the municipal code, dustbins are a massive threat to the general public. Delinquents will be sentenced to grimaces and contortions in jail. Signed, Mc... Dustbin. So it hit him, too. Completely nuts. That's why I... All right. But Greta has locked herself in her chamber. We got out. If... I'll be go... Hello, Father Bartholomew. Uh, hello. I have a rit- Very good. The ritual schedule is complete. You've done extremely well, my son. Do you also have all the- Now I have everything we need for Greta, and Bill will get Greta into the circle once I get her out of her chambers. And I already know how to- I just have to ring the bell in the tower. The ringing of the holy bell should drive her out of the church. Excellent, my son. Then get yourself up into the top. I'll wait. Another one of the. The ball's in the tube. That's probably where the ball needs to go up. Anselm won't be any help to me here. Hmm, that could work.
Right. The ball is one level further up. On we go. That sailing thingy there seems to be pushed to the left by the bellows. Why would I... things are somehow reacting to the noise but not quite enough <laughs> This cannot continue. I'm putting a stop to this. I am taking you with me. What? Stop me? You have tyrannized Heaven's Hope enough. That's going to stop right now. What? No! No! Peter! Judas! You Ferris! But me! Oh, wow. Well... Oh, I'm glad you're finally here. She's becoming crazier by the minute. Are you ready? Yeah. Do you have every the sword, the key, and the four elements in their purest forms? Yep, I have everything. Good. Then, here we go. Enter the circle, Talarel. Come on! Or are you going to let this wretch give you orders? Now, put the consecrated soil in the bowl before the sacred stone. Thus, you bind Greta's body. What? What are you doing? Once I'm free, I'll take care of the priest first, and then you! You won't escape me! I'll find you, and then I'll pull you apart, bit by bit! Now bind Greta's feelings with the holy water. What are you doing? You can't stop me! I'll destroy you in this entire miserable existence! Now subdue her will! With the fire! <sighs> Worm is the fire's henchman. In heaven he too is not but a priest. Go find me! Worm of sick jealousy. He who seeks shall in time find out that time heals all wounds that come around time after time. Now the air. Bind her mind. Go, my son, and cut the demon from her. Vade retro satanas. Lord in heaven, help us.
of all people. You associate with sinners, these filthy wretches. You do not deserve heaven. Anyone who consorts with earthlings fails the kingdom of heaven. But everything down here is God's creation, so... God's creation? What do I care about God's creation? I am an angel. I belong in heaven. Uh... But you did me a favor. You freed my spirit from that little wretch. And now I... <laughs> what? No! 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 Oh my, it looks like Umarel won't be seeing heaven for a while. What? What happened? Where am I? And who am I? Uh... She... she seems to have lost her memory. That? That opens a whole range of new possibilities. You, you're a holy martyr. Yes, exactly. You came in heaven's name and helped entire armies defeat their enemies and kings to gain their thrones. In reward, your father was exempted from having to pay taxes. Uh, Talarel, really? Uh, did you, didn't she fight for France and against England a good 400 years ago? But wasn't she burned at the stake in Rouen at the age of 19? It fits. Oh. Very well. Then I shall go spread the word of the Lord. Just great, Talarel. Now she's convinced that the Lord sent her, and she's probably looking for a sword as we speak. One of the ritual stones for the protective circle. My... my Anselm! Oh no! He became a soul vessel during the ritual. Is there nothing we can do? Talarel, there must be something you can do. My... is... Oh boy! I'll just turn it at the moment. It won't work. Why? I'm afraid. Thank Admit it, Azale. You would have missed the little guy, too. No comment. There you are. 
It's about time. Yeah, uh, the, the demon and the exorcism. Be that as it may, I already tied off the rope we're going to have to use for a makeshift mooring mast over there. Get the other end up there and tie it off at the top. And while you're doing that, I'll get the portable gasometer. Uh-huh, certainly. No help at all. The rope has to go up there, and I can't reach. Wow. Hmm. Yeah, that could work. No help at all. I'm afraid the little furball won't be able to help here. Aha! Very well done. Now we have a mooring mast for the flying machine. Let's see if we can get it up here. Ah, there you are at last. And I see that you have our impromptu mooring mast mounted. Here's the portable gasometer. Connect it to the burner, light the burner, and then pump the air into the balloon. I'll go on up and wait for you. Hmm. You can't light it like that. It will burn through the envelope. You'll have to hold... Good. Hmm. It won't stay in the right position. I'll have to hold... Hmm. I'll have to light the... Anselm won't be any... Let's see. No, I can't let go of it, because it'll fall over again. So many people. I... I think they all came to say goodbye to you. Okay, that's something that I never expected. He surely doesn't really want to fly. That, that, that's blasphemous. It's all right. I, uh, I don't know what to say. Well, you have to say something. Thank you. Th that was it. Hush, Azael. Let him finish. Thank you. For letting me get to know all of you. For letting me learn so much from you. You know, about life, matter, and all the rest. And for all of you helping me to better understand what it is to be alive. Here, here. Really? Uh, when I came down here... You mean, when you crashed? I had no idea of this world and what it's like to walk through it on your own two legs. Now I'm going back to heaven and have learned so much. Did he say he's going to heaven? Shh. It's all right. Well then, cast off. What is it that you always do? I wish all of you all the best. And maybe we'll see one another again in heaven someday. Take care, Effendi. A pleasant journey, Talarel. God bless you, Talarel. All the best there, Talarel. Fly carefully, Talarel.
Hello, I'm back. Oh, great. Fantastic. And I've got so many stories to tell you. That's just what we need. Where is everyone? That's it! Talk about unbelievable! Here's me coming back with the story of the century, and no one wants to hear it! Shh! Otherwise, you'll hear it and come over. I've had it! I'm out of here! Furball, Anselm, we're going! 